Hey guys, I'm Jonas. Today I'm going to show you how to install our canister style air cleaner kits on the new style Kawasaki FS series engines. So Kawasaki has been making the FS series engine for over 10 years now. But around 2018, 2019 is when most manufacturers would have started phasing in this new style FS engine. Now both the old version and the new version are still called FS engines, so the only way to tell which one you have is to visually inspect your engine. Now it's pretty easy to tell the difference if you just know what you're looking for. On both the old and the new versions, they use these quarter turn locks to secure the air filter cover onto the blower housing. But on the new versions, this air filter cover is significantly larger and when you remove this cover, you're going to see two large inspection holes on either side of your air filter. Now in the older version, you're not going to see any inspection holes and the air filter cover is quite a bit smaller. Now this kit is going to work on the Kawasaki FS651, the FS691, and the FS730. Now we do have the kits for the old style and the new style available on our website at powerequipmentman.com. To get started installing our air cleaner kit, the first thing we need to do is remove your air filter cover along with the old air filter and intake tube assembly. We are going to be reusing this hose clamp with your new kit. We're also going to need to remove these two rubber bumpers on either side of the blower housing. Now we can install our new air filter mounting bracket using two of the plastic push pins included in the kit. Then you'll use a 5 16 drill bit to drill out the other two holes in your mounting bracket and install the other two plastic push pins. Now we can install the two long hose clamps included in your kit. You're going to insert the hose clamp through the small hole at the top of the mounting bracket and back out the small hole at the bottom of the bracket. Next, we can install our new intake tube onto the air filter canister using one of the small hose clamps in the kit. The longer portion of the intake tube is going to be going down towards your carburetor. Now you can install your new intake tube down onto the carburetor using the hose clamp that we retained from earlier. Then you can use the two large hose clamps to secure our canister to the mounting bracket. Just leave these clamps loose for now. To install these clamps, you can use a flathead screwdriver or a 9-30-second socket. Now you can just take a minute before we tighten everything down to make sure that the canister is aligned with the opening for our dust cap sticking straight up. Now you can go ahead and tighten down all four hose clamps. The last thing that we need to do is install our dust cap using the other small hose clamp that's provided in your kit. Now you can find these kits for the old style and the new style FS engines as well as our kit for the FR series engines on our website at powerequipmentman.com. Well that's going to wrap it up for today guys. If you got some good value out of this video, please hit that thumbs up button. Consider subscribing. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.